I need to light my candle. <laughs> I almost started without lighting my candle, man. What is up with that? Who starts without lighting their candle? Huh? I ain't no smoker, so my lighter don't work. There you go. Hey, welcome, welcome, welcome back to another episode. I'm your man's Gamage, aka Got Gamage, the country boy. And ladies and gentlemen, I am so excited that you decided to click that button and hang out with your mans for a minute. So since you're here, make sure you like, subscribe, share this with at least three people, huh? But ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, I have so much to get in with you guys tonight. I'm so excited. As you already know by the title of the thumbnail, we got mayo, mayo, yo. How it goes. We got mail from Brownells, ladies and gentlemen. And anytime we get, well, not anytime, but most of the time we get mail from Brownells, we got to check it out with y'all. So without further ado, Let's get a sip of the kids' outfit, huh? Ah. Oh, I forgot to tell y'all. So, tonight, one of the things I think I'm going to start doing, we did it on the last one, but one of the things I'm going to start doing, I want to make sure that you guys just get, get exposed to a few of my pieces. So, tonight's desk pop is none other than the Glock 48. Now, no mag, no mag, unload and show clear. Now, this particular firearm is an amazing piece, ladies and gentlemen. It's a Glock 48, but we have the signature Poseidon ports by none other than Floyd's Custom Shop. Now, as you can see, side ports on both sides. Me love it, me love it. S top windows, man. This gun is such a flat shooter, and the custom work was done, the Cerakote work was done by none other than Trigger Dad down in Northport, Florida. Shouts out to my man's Trigger's dad, and not only is he a phenomenal Cerakoter, but ladies and gentlemen, he also happens to be one of my squad bros. We bangs together. Um, trigger is a Ranger Proof Trigger, which I love Ranger Proof Triggers. The Eyes Holosyn 507K. 507k and um we also have a hold grip on ours i got this hold grip from my man's jw phenomenal youtuber as well i'll drop his link down in the bottom but um yeah man that right there mirror glow sights most people don't use their sights when they use red dot but uh i do still so um that's our desk pop of the evening desk pop firearm that'll be with us let's get into this mail call huh Woo. Now, as always, I've already opened the box. I've peeked through it already, mm, but I'm so excited to share it with y'all. So I'm going to kind of just pull it all out and then we'll kind of just go through it and look at it. You know, I don't know what I'm going to do, but you with me, so let's do it. Brown L's, let's go. So as you guys know, you may not know, I am building, I'm in the process of building another AR-9. And anytime you're building anything, um, you have to check out the inventory at brownells.com. Now, listen to me. I've shopped with a bunch of other sites. And if, one, if, if you're like me, who, by show of your hands, and you're going to be able to call the name of the sites, but I ain't going to snitch on nobody because we don't do that. You don't get advertisement out of my mouth for no reason. But you know who you are. How many of you guys have ordered things from site? It says in stock. You add it to the cart, you get to check out, they take your money. And then you get an email right after that that says, sorry, this item is not in stock, but we will notify you when it's back in stock. What the crap? Ooh, coffee sip. Who does that? Why take my money if you ain't got it in stock? That's the main, ladies and gentlemen, that's one of the most important features of a website to actually have what it is you are selling. If not, just point me to your Facebook page. Point, point me over to your Instagram. If I just want to look at pictures, huh? 
anyway, let's get into this goddamn box, ladies and gentlemen. So, Endomags, three pack, Endomags. You don't know what the Endomag is? I'll tell you in a minute. Ooh, a Brownells exclusive CMC triggers. Now, if you know about CMC triggers, you know how light they are. Um, but ladies and gentlemen, this is a Brownells exclusive. So we had to build this in this AR9 because this particular AR9, it's going to be a Brownells exclusive piece. You see what I'm saying? You, you'll see what I'm saying. Um, okay, okay. Magpul hand stop. Let's go, Magpul. Brownells. 30 round magazine. Bada bing, bada boom. Lay that right there. Huh. What do you know? Another Brownells 30 round magazine. Bada bing, bada boom. Okay. The Ergo Grip. We need the Ergo Grip on there. Um, I'm going to show you this. However, this Noveski Model K. This one right here is the Flaming Pig, but I did not get this one from Brownells. I got this one right here from my man's King. Uh, my man's King, he is a phenomenal Instagrammer, uh, phenom phenomenal tattoo artist. I'm going to link his stuff down below because I got to shout him out. Um, reached out to him, asked him about some AR9 stuff. He told me, hey man, I got some stuff that I'm going to just send to you. So... That's that's another thing that makes this particular bill super special. So I'm excited about this. Flaming Pig. And oh yes. We got oh there it is. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, details. We got the AR9 boat carrier group, but we got the Brownells exclusive. Huh? You see that on there? I think that deserves a coffee sip. Huh? Brownells exclusive and ladies and gentlemen. I got it. I got it. I got it. Who out there already know it's flannel season, baby? You know it's flannel season. I'm going to open this one first because you got to see it. Huh? Let's do it. Let's do it. Retro slice blade. Cut a little slit slit, huh? Cut a little slit slit. Ow! Look at that, look at that! Ow! Look at that, look at that! Ow! It's flannel season, y'all. It's flannel season, y'all. Ooh, look at that right there. That, listen, I already know. You, you might not can see it, but I hope that 4K lets you see how this color just resonates with my skin tone, huh? I'm geeked up about this one, y'all. But, guys, it's now time. Let's unveil some of this stuff and actually put the AR9 together. So, what I did not show you is I have the upper already, already assembled. We currently are running, uh, got my Unity riser on there. Bam, won that in a raffle off of IG, loving it. Um, we got Radiant Arms, uh, dual charging handle, I'm geeked up about. But this mag, this mag I mean, this uh, muzzle brick right here, we got this one from another homie of my Garage Gunsmith. I got to tag him in the bottom as well, because dope dude, super dope dude. We got the entire upper and the barrel. I got an upper and the barrel from another one of my homies, um, J Peel. Gotta shout him out as well. The rail for this baby actually came from my dog, King. And as you can see, this is a family build. You see what I'm saying? Now, you know me. I normally build stuff and doctor it up and get it all fancy and pretty. And then sometimes I get rid of it. This one, this is a family build. And um, you don't mess with family. Squad drills. Now that deserves a coffee seal huh i love that new orleans chicory mm. so upper lower came in the mail the other day had to go to my gun shop my particular gun shop gun craft and um they're my ffl as well and uh we picked it up 
it is a i think it was a radical arms radical arms lower it's a yep radical firearms standard lower but um you say this is a uh a ar9 build but where's the little small where, where's the little small piece that goes in why isn't this mag well small to take the little glock mags and the coke mags i try to tell you i don't like pistols like that you know what i'm saying i like my ar9 to look like an ar15 yet the only way to do that that's where the endo mags come in baby so now as we're doing this i'm gonna be unboxing but i'm gonna be putting some of this stuff together as well because i want you to see this go from this and all these pieces to the full final product so now some of this we might jump oh 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 oh, oh. wait 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 i forgot to tell you so i also picked up for the AR9 to complete it all. But well, last thing I need to get is an optic for it, but not 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 sweating that one just yet. Oh man. The Maxim Defense Brace. This, ladies and gentlemen, is going to be a beauty. And as you can see, it's in the brown L's brown. Ah, ooh, coffee sip. It's in the brown ale brown, baby. Brown ale brown. Ooh, this is going to be beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Let's get to work. Huh? <laughs> Next, let's go ahead and pop open one of these mags and drop an endo conversion piece in it. Brown ale brown. I like that. I like that. Let's open this first. Take one of the endo mags. Ladies and gentlemen, we actually had to step away for a second because um, in my attempt to put the uh, endo mag in the Brownells Brown, Brownells Brown, um, I realized the endo mag doesn't go into freaking metal mags. It has to be a Gen 2, a Gen 3. Um, it has to be a Gen 2, a Gen 3. Polymer mag or P-Mag. So we take this out, take the whole inside guts out. Five, five, six guts. Bada bing, bada boom. Slot the whole endo mag. Uh oh. Inside. Snap your cap, wrap back. Bada bing, bada boom. And now you have nine millimeter. Nine millimeter. So I'm gonna have to label these so that I know which ones are for the nine millimeter. Bada bing, bada boom. So ladies and gentlemen, now you can see we have a nine millimeter. We have an AR-15 standard magazine and we removed the guts and replaced it with the endo mag, the mean endo mags, which converts it into nine millimeter. And now I have a full size looking mag versus that little conversion. I don't want a, an adapter in there. So much so, some ammo. We'll just take three of them real quick. Look at that. Bada bing, bada boom. I like that. I like that. I like that. Bam, bam. Nine millimeter, ladies and gentlemen. 
Bada bing. Bada boom. Next up, ladies and gentlemen, let's go ahead and install the CMC freaking Brownells exclusive flat trigger. Now, I don't have no problem with curves. I don't have a problem with curves. Eh? However, I do like my triggers flat. Eh? <laughs> get out of here. Y'all silly. Okay, let's go ahead and get this thing changed out, man. You know what I need to order next? I need to order me some Brownells tools. I've seen my man's Faith Kills Fear. I've seen him running some uh, Brownells tools, and uh, I like them. So um, I'm going to get me some. flat trigger installed and it makes this baby all the more sweet put our safety switch dual safety switch back on bada bing bada boom Safety. Ooh, that's light. Ooh, that's light. Ooh, that's light. Bada bing, bada boom. Now, let's switch to the upper. Nine millimeter bolt carrier. Exclusive brown nails. <laughs> let's see how this thing fit, man. See that on this particular upper that window isn't open enough where we can see the brown L's hmm I know it's cut fancy so that you know we can get that reflection off from the brass but uh it's nine millimeter like I think I'm gonna take that in and have a machine it some I need that open more I need to see the brown L's on this baby here Let's fit it and see what we look like so far. All right, all right, all right, all right. All right. Ooh, those pins tight. Ooh. Let's listen. Safety is on fire. Listen to that CMC. Reset. Oh. Oh. Empty mag. Empty mag. I'm loving it. I'm loving it. I'm loving it. We got one more thing to change on this. This hideous butt stock. Let's get to work. It's pretty tight. I'm gonna go to the vice and I'll be right back. 
table, empty mag, empty gun, ladies and gentlemen, AR-9. Brown Ale's exclusive AR9. Ooh. Empty mag. It locked back on an empty mag. I'm happy. Now, really quick, let's go ahead and install the M lock hand stop. All right. I'm not gonna tighten everything down too tight because we gotta get this thing shipped off to or dropped off down at uh, Trigger Dance to get him to Cerakote it and finish it up. But uh, AR9, Brownells exclusive. Still gotta get a red dot. There we have it, ladies and gentlemen. The AR-9 is, I'll say 70, 75% complete. Things that we still need, we need to switch out the muzzle brake. Um, we need to Cerakote it. We also need to get a red dot for it. And um, we will be finished. Um, this again is the family build. Not going to get rid of it because it means a lot to me. Shouts out to King. Shouts out to J Peel. Shouts out to um, my man Jonathan. Shouts out to Garage Gunsmith. Shouts out to who else? Dalton. Shouts out to Darius. Shouts out to Jay. Shouts out to Ghost. Um... These guys made this possible, man. And uh, I'm geek. I'm stoked about it. A few more things we got to get done to it, but I dig it. I dig it a lot. There we have it, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for joining us for another episode. And uh, I look forward to coming back with you on the next mail call. Um, until then... Make sure that you like the video, subscribe to the video, share it with at least three people and comment down below. What did you see that you're like, you know what? I would have changed this. I would have added this. Give me some recommendation. What are your thoughts? What kind of red dot should I go with? Since we already got the Unity High Rise, what red dot should we go with? Should we stick with this Battle Shroud uh, 9 millimeter muzzle comp or should we put the Flaming Pig on there? Which one? Give me your advice. Ladies and gentlemen, have you used the endo mags? What is your take on them? Do you like them? Would you prefer the actual converted mag? What, like, what, what, what do you like? Ladies and gentlemen, that's been it. I'm your man's gamage, and I can't wait to sit down at the desk with you again. But until then, remember, never compare, never complain, and never compete. Why? Because you are the threat. Deuces. Well, I'll let you next time.